Hi folks, welcome to the Don's channel. I am the Don Father. For everybody um, outside of Scotland, you will have absolutely no idea what this is. Um, basically, this meal is something that I got as a child when I went to my grandparents' house. I absolutely loved it. It's the most basic of basic meals. I'm not sure where it originates from, but if I was going to take a kind of educated guess, I would say it was like a rationed meal during the, the World War, back in World War II, maybe the First World War, the Great War, I'm not too sure. So basically, this meal is called Stovies. It is as basic as they come. I've took the liberty of, of preparing, cubing the potatoes, so I've cubed potatoes. I have got a lot in there because I'm going to do it for the whole family. So basically, mm -hmm. cubed potatoes. I've diced. I've diced two onions, rough, rough dicing, there's a little bit of corned beef there, tinned corned beef, there's absolutely nothing fancy about this meal. There you are, just a normal tin of corned beef, I've opened it up, I've not put it in yet, just for the purposes of showing you the ingredients. And a little bit of salt and pepper, not too much because the kids are going to be eating it, so just add to your own personal preference. Salt and pepper. So. That's the ingredients for stovies. I'll get it all in the pot. I'll put a little bit of a video of it bubbling away. It really doesn't need to be overcooked. Just cook it until the potatoes are soft and they've started to dissolve a little bit into the mix and all the corned beef. Use the whole tin of corned beef, put it in and it should all sort of dissolve into a, a mix. But don't boil the potatoes away so they're, they're completely dissolved into a mush. Still have them so they're lightly cubed but um, melted away a little bit. And of course the onions are cooked. Stovies. And after this here, after it's cooked, I'll explain to you the best thing about stovies when I was young. What I used to love doing with them, alright? Thanks guys. Right, so for the purposes of the video I thought even though it's the most basic thing to cook. So, so easy, any numpty can do it. Uh, that's why I can do it. Um, I just thought, I better show them just how unpretty uh, this is um, to cook. It's just a basic, basic thing. But some people might want a little bit of a video description. So, as I say, Anybody can do it. I'm kind of just getting that to the boil there, the cubed potatoes and out. I'm just going to launch in the onions with it. It doesn't matter how cooked they are. And I'm going to put the corned beef in as well. That bit of corned beef. Just launch it in. Absolutely no... Um, no nice way to do it. Doesn't matter. Doesn't need to be pretty. Back out of the way, a second, friends. Just gonna, there you have it, just scooping that out of the tin. There is fatty bits in the corned beef, you can trim that off, but it doesn't really matter. It all melts down into the cooking. It'll break up anyway. I'll break it up a little bit anyway, it'll help it get mixed around. So. I've actually cut myself a little bit on the tip. I'm just going to add a little bit of salt. I don't want to put too much in. Pepper. 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 Friends, you put in the pepper. Is that enough? Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. I'll move all this out of the way. Keep going. Very. That'll do. Just for the demonstration. So, salt and pepper. Put enough in to your taste. I'm just going to give it a little bit of a stir there. All right. And I don't know if the camera can see that, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to move it over a little bit and tilt that. That's what it means. So, as I say, the most basic of meals. It will, it will actually um, boil down. Obviously, as I said, you don't want to completely. Boil the potatoes till they turn to a complete mush. Have them so they're, 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 they're not cubed completely, but they're, they're a little bit soft and mushy, but still visible potato. 
that's when it's at its best. But the corned beef will all melt into the whole thing, the onions will be cooked and it'll all be lovely. So, as I said, when we come to eating it, I'll show you what my favourite thing to do is with stovies, okay? Thanks guys. So now we have it, um, the stovies are done, um, everybody's got some, <laughs> Sarge has already started, Boss Baby's already started, but the surprise or the secret thing to do um, is, is get a heavily buttered bread. Is what I've got is a thick bit of uh, plain bread, loads of butter, loads of butter, don't be shy with the butter. Um, that's what it looks like. I don't like butter and I don't I've like actually dipped out on the corned beef, it's probably more in the pot, but just for this I'm going to show you. Keep it watery, don't boil the water away. The reason being, dip away, dip away, tell me what you think, react and tell them what you think of the stovies. I'm probably going to get plain bread after. Basically, um, you want to keep the water in and that's this is because you want something to dip your bread in. Um, add some salt and pepper after if you've got kids and to your own flavour because you don't want to put too much salt in your kids meal. Anyway, boil it for about 25-30 minutes. Big bit of plain bread, loads of butter, dip it in. The daughter mother doesn't want to eat her dinner in front of me, mama. That is absolutely legendary. What do you think, girls? I'd probably yeah. like it with the plain bread more. And chicken and water piece. Mm -hmm. Loads of bread. I mean, when you eat bread with butter, it probably doesn't make it very healthy, but it's unbelievable. You have to try it. Any bread will do, like a tiger bread, whatever. Mm, Slice it yourself. Do you like that? Why didn't you get tiger bread? Why didn't you get tiger bread? I don't know why I didn't get a loaf that we could slice ourselves. Yeah, tiger bread to And butter in it. Mm, absolutely brilliant. This brings back memories for me as a child. Getting it off my grandparents. It's good memories. Is there any <laughs> meals that you maybe... <laughs> is there any me meals that maybe you got as a child? That brings back good memories of you to try and then maybe of your grandparents or just something that just on a winter's night that you'd enjoy. Let me know. Anyway, there you have it, Stovies. What do you think? Mom! Thumbs up from us. Um, I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope you tried Stovies. Good potatoes, onions, tin of corned beef, bit of salt and pepper, boil it, don't boil all the water away. Butter your bread heavily, dip it in, absolute treat. This is a Scottish basic Mom, Scottish meal. Easy meal. Try it guys. Thanks very much. Mommy. This is the dog's channel. We've enjoyed it and I'm gonna get to eating. Goodbye.